This week on In the Kitchen with Pete, we're doing a delicious asparagus rice. It'll have some Asian inspired flavors. Let's start out with a little bit of prep work. There's a tough end on the asparagus that will naturally snap off about two inches in. Now rather than snapping each one off, you've already done the one, you can judge where the rest of them need to be cut. Just simply slice through the whole bunch. We could discard those, always use them for soup. And then simply cut them into about half inch pieces. We'll give those a rinse and then set them aside. Next we'll need about a half a cup of red onions. You want this finely diced so you can run your knife through them a couple of times. Our next item will need two cloves of garlic. I've got two large cloves here and we'll finely dice those up as well. We'll also need a half of red bell pepper. Dice that up and let's get over to the stove. In a large skillet, medium to high heat, we'll add a teaspoon of butter and a teaspoon of olive oil. Add the onions and then add the asparagus and then add in our finely diced garlic. Now our next item is a chili garlic sauce. This will add some terrific flavor. You only need about one to two teaspoons. Mix well and, oh, almost forgot. We have to add our red bell pepper as well. Then we'll stir in about a half an ounce of water, cover it for about three or four minutes to help soften up the vegetables. For this recipe, you'll need two cups of cooked rice. Here's a quick way, Uncle Ben's Bistro Express. It's already cooked, just pour it right in. Now some more flavor. Two tablespoons of oyster or hoisin sauce. Two tablespoons of soy sauce. And the juice of a half of a lime. Mix this well, cover it, and when it's heated thoroughly, it's ready to serve. Look at the colors. It really is a beautiful dish and makes a great side for any dinner. Well, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. I appreciate it. And don't forget to hit that little red subscribe button down below. You'll get notified every time I put out a new video. Thanks for watching In the Kitchen with Pete. Until next time, see ya.